Did you know that mushrooms are actually a fungus? But what do you think would happen if we damaged one of these areas? When I was two, I started being really curious and of course that drew me to science because science is like 99% curiosity. When I was four, I was like, Mommy, I've learned so much and I want to share my knowledge with the world. We started with YouTube, then graduated to Instagram, and then now we're on Facebook and TikTok. This is the most important meal of the day. And you know why? Because when you eat food, you get nutrients. And the nutrients give get processed into energy by your cells. And guess what? That gives you energy to start your day. I have a presentation on the immune system. I feel overwhelmed because um, we started this with a passion. He wanted to teach. Our intention wasn't to go viral and go all over the place, but he wanted to teach the whole world. And then the whole world came to see the good works that he was doing. And as parents, that really gives us a lot of joy because first of all, he's fulfilling his mission and then also he's educating the world. Science isn't some boring textbook subject with all the math, math, business, business. It's fun and it's all around you. Like see, even just dropping this pencil, I applied like three million science principles. My message to other parents is that we pay more attention to our kids because they start demonstrating these giftings at a very young age. So pay attention to them. And then as soon as you identify that this child of mine likes this, you as a parent do whatever you can to support that child, to bring that nature, that uh, giftings that a child has. One more tip of advice, don't forget to keep on science.